All right, what's going on? Let's take a look at finding the inverse of a rational function. So you can see here we have f of x is equal to four is equal to six x plus four over four x plus five. All right, so to find the inverse, the first thing we want to do is we want to change f of x to y. So we've got y equals 6x plus 4 over 4x plus 5. All right, next you want to swap the x's and y's. So the y you want to change to an x and the two x's you want to change those to a y. And then you solve for y. All right, so to solve for y here, what we're going to, what we'll do is we'll put this over one and then we can just cross multiply. So we'll have x times 4y plus 5 equals 1 times 6y plus 4. And then we just and like I said, we solve for y. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to distribute the x and we'll distribute the 1. Right, so that's going to give us 4xy plus 5x equals 6y plus 4. Now, we're solving for y, so everything that has a y has to come to one side of the equal sign, and everything that doesn't have a y goes to the other side of the equal sign. So I need to move this 6y over here and the 5x over here. So I'm going to subtract 6y to both sides, and I'm going to subtract 5x to both sides. And that's going to leave us with 4xy minus 6y equals, and let's see, that's going to be negative 5x plus 4. All right, now notice here how I have a common factor of y. I can factor that out. So let's factor out that y. So y is equal, I'm sorry. So that's going to leave me y times 4x minus 6 equals negative 5x plus 4. See, all I did, I factored out the y. Then we'll do what? Divide both sides by 4x minus 6. And that will leave us with y equals negative 5x plus 4 over 4x minus 6. And then once you solve for y, you just change the y to the f inverse. And so that's over 4x minus 6. And there's your inverse. All right, so... I hope the video helped. Uh, check out my other videos. Give me a like, share, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.